Hi there. My name is Molly and I'm a librarian at the Wyzetta branch of Hennepin County Library and I am here today to do a baby story time with you and I'm really excited. Let's get started. So our very first thing we need to do is introduce my baby. If you've watched my previous baby story time, some of you may be familiar with Moose. This is my friend Moose. As I mentioned before, I don't have a baby at home, so he is my stand-in for a baby. And I'm going to introduce him like this. Moose is here today. Moose is here today. Yay, Moose! Alright, so parents or caregivers or special people, can you introduce your baby? Alright, let's do it together. Moose is here today. Moose is here today. Yay, Moose! That was really fun, wasn't it, Moose? Moose says it is. All right, now it's time to sing our opening song, and it goes like this. Hello, 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 and how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine, and I hope that you are too. Hello, 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 and how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine, and I hope that you are too. Well, hello, and welcome. Should we read our story, Moose? Yeah? All right. So for this, I'm going to set Moose aside so I can read our story. We'll put him right here. All right. And I'm going to get our book. This is the big book of beautiful babies. And it is by David L. Wand. I really love using this book in my baby story times because it has lots of really great pictures of beautiful babies. Um, this book talks about emotions and it talks about body parts. So I encourage your adult people who are with you and the babies in story time, you can model the emotions for your baby. So if it talks about being happy, you can smile. And if it talks about being sad, you can be sad. Um, it book also talks about body parts, so you can, if it talks about hands, you can point out hands. Um, helping, pointing out the emotions, connecting them to the book, and pointing out body parts, and also connecting them to pages, and showing your children body parts or the emotions on themselves. It helps them learn about different emotions and body parts, but it also helps them connect that the words coming out of your mouth are have a connection to the pages of the story. All right, let's get started. Baby happy, baby sick. All right, so we have one baby who's happy baby who's sad. So, so one who's happy and one who's sad. And that's okay. We experience lots of different emotions throughout the day. Baby good, baby bad. Now, I don't like to think of anybody as bad, just not good behavior. But it looks like baby who's looking very happy and maybe doing what they're supposed to and a baby who's playing with flower maybe not doing what they're supposed to baby hands baby feet this would be a great time to point out the hands or feet on your baby Baby messy and baby clean, or baby neat, the book says. 
Oh, we've got a messy baby. Maybe your baby at home. Maybe they like to play with their food. Yeah. I've seen a lot of babies playing with their food. But then you can get them all cleaned up and make it neat. <gasps> baby laugh. Baby cry. Baby, they're laughing, having fun. And this baby's crying. There's lots of reasons to cry. Maybe the baby's sad or hungry. I just don't know. But that's okay. We all have emotions. And sometimes crying is how you express that. <sighs> baby wet. Baby dry. All right. And this baby looks like came out of the shower or bathtub maybe and then the baby this baby's getting dry with a towel oh that's fun all right baby dressed baby bear all right so this baby is dressed this baby's bear Baby bald and baby's hair. So this baby doesn't have any hair, but this baby does have hair. Isn't that fun? Babies can look so different. <gasps> baby bottom, baby top. All right, so here's one baby's bottom and another baby's top. Baby start, baby stop. So these babies, they're moving. And this baby's not moving. Looks like the baby's asleep. Maybe they're tired. Baby quiet, baby loud. And this baby's sleeping, so they're not making much noise. But this baby, it looks like he's on a drum there, making a lot of noise. Baby shy and baby proud. This baby's a little bit shy, maybe not feeling, not talking to people today. And that's cool. And this baby, they're like, hey, welcome. I'm excited to talk to people today. And you know what? Either one of those, that's okay. Baby one, babies two. So on this page we have one baby, on this page we have two. That's so exciting. And best of all, a place for you and you can see my camera there <laughs> but if you were reading the book with your baby that fun mirror you'd be able to see it yourself maybe you can get out a mirror at home and show the, your baby themselves and help them make that connection that their reflection is them that's pretty pretty cool huh put away our book and get out our fingers. All right. And our f this is our finger family. So first we're going to kick our finger family up and then we're going to put our finger family down. And then they're going to dance on our shoulders, dance on our heads, dance on our knees. You can't see my knees, but they're there. To bed. All right, let's sing together. Finger family up and finger family down. Finger family dancing all around the town. Dancing on my shoulder, dancing on my head, dancing on my knees. Now tuck them into bed. Oh, 
that was really great. Let's do it again. Okay, let's do it again all together. All right. Finger family up and finger family down. Finger family dancing all around the town. Dancing on my shoulder, dancing on my head, dancing on my knees. Now tuck them into bed. Yay! That was really great. Alrighty. Now for this, I'm going to use a scarf. Now I have a scarf. Maybe you don't have a scarf at home. That's okay. You can use a blanket or a dish towel or maybe you have a handkerchief. Whatever you have on hand at home will work. And for this, we're gonna, it's called popcorn kernels. So we gotta get our popcorn kernels and wrap them up in our pot like this. And we're gonna sing this song. <clears throat> popcorn kernels, popcorn kernels in the pot in the pot shake them shake them shake them shake them shake them shake them till they pop till they pop well that was a lot of fun we should do it again shouldn't we all right wrap your popcorn kernel into your pot wrap it in the pot all right popcorn kernels popcorn kernels in the pot, in the pot. Shake them, shake them, shake them. Shake them, shake them, shake them. Till they pop, till they pop. Oh, yay. That was so much fun. And as much as I'd love to keep going, fortunately it's time for baby story time to end. But before I go, I just want to mention, please keep talking, reading, writing, singing, and playing with your babies as much as you are able. It's really great for their development. You can check out our Facebook page for virtual story times. And please check out our website for other online resources such as ebooks. All right, let's sing our goodbye song. For that, I'm gonna bring back Moose here and we'll sing our goodbye song, which goes like this. Now it's time to say goodbye, say goodbye, say goodbye. Now it's time to say goodbye, goodbye friends. Goodbye friends.